have hidden talents. You might be surprised by some of the things we're about to show you right now. Please welcome designer Kimberly Seldon. <laughs> surprises for you today so many so, so many for example let's yes. start here what does this look like a gorgeous piece of art it does right mm -hmm. but it does so much more it has a hidden talent and the hidden talent is this it's actually a radiator or a heater oh. baby can heat up to a hundred square foot room. It's from ILO Technology. Nice. You can have any piece of art you want. It's customizable. You can see that it's here in just a clean black. So if you're sleek and modern and uber yeah. and you're, you know, sometimes you live in a condo and you don't have total control over the heating in the building and yep. you're freezing, you just turn it up. It can be quite warm. Um, unlike a stove, which when you touch it, you'll burn your hands. You yes. will not burn your hands. Oh, here it is in the bedroom. So there's the art that is amazing right, above the just, bed and it's a radiator. Just to warm you up. Your husband will have no idea why it's always so warm in the bedroom. <laughs> we won't tell him there's a little control switch there on the back. Let me show you the ones from the bathroom too. This is genius because here we've got towel bars in front of it. So yeah. that's really going to heat up a hundred square feet of a bathroom. You imagine stepping out of the shower and being able to feel that radiation yeah. and your towels can touch it so it can also heat your towels. That is incredible. I love And it's technology. clean and crisp. I love how it looks. It's like a fave product of ours. I think I've had it on the show before. This. A lovely piece of art. It right? is <laughs> until you reveal what's <gasps> behind it. Jewelry hanger. That's so cute. For those of you who have jewels worth preserving, right? Yeah, yeah right? of course. Yes. Or anything else you want. Sharon, Sharon's house. Yes. She's a clever little minx. Well, she has hidden quite a few things uh, right. behind pieces of art. We've got pictures from Sharon's place. So, gorgeous piece of art, as you can see. Now look what, what's behind it. Her electrical panel, right? Which is very cool. I think that's a great idea because no one likes the electrical panel. Like it never looks pretty. It never looks pretty. Yeah, so. there's no way to make that look right. I mean, I think if you get clever, you can really put your home to work for you. You can't, bit, right? So let's talk about this here. We've got a faucet. Guess it's what a, it is? It's very a car. It's a no. <laughs> what does it it's do? A it's a Delta faucet, so we know it delivers water beautifully. It's from Home Depot, so we know it's well priced. Yes. And it's got a pull down function, right? Okay. First time in the bathroom. We're used For to them the in the bathroom. kitchens, yes. but we're not used to seeing them in the bathroom. And yeah. so, toothpaste, you know how it's hard so to get that? Your husband shaves and he leaves those little Nasty. black hairs. Like, what is that? Yes. Why don't they yes. clean them? But now they'll be like, whoo. And if he doesn't clean them, now you can go like this. <laughs> Right? That's right. So good really good. Lost. Okay, so what do we have here? We've got a, a beautiful little lamp. It's a lamp. Mm -hmm. And it's got a couple of functions as well. I've got my phone sitting here because yeah. you can automatically charge your phone now. Nice. Just lay it there. I like Excellent. That. I like to be able to automatically charge me. I know. <laughs> That's what coffee. Just lay for. on it. See if it works. Um, it also has a USB charger as well. So oh, you can good. plug something else in. So that's really handy. Yes. And over here we've got a beautiful cart. Lovely. You know, summertime is coming and outdoor entertaining. Yeah. This cart's hidden talent is that it also has outlets oh, and USBs. Nice. So if you're gonna do some outdoor entertaining, you do have to plug the back of the cart in. Yeah. But now you can put your blender here and ah. deliver some margaritas, right? Very smart. And this is this is the situation that we are in now. Everything you need an outlet for everything. I thought you were gonna say we always need alcohol. We always need margaritas. Right. This is the right. situation we are I'm in so now. So close you to need knowing a drink. where we're going. <laughs> okay, and these are from HomeSense. I love nice. it. So very affordable great looking products love it okay this little baby I swear it doesn't look like much but this is genius right now you have outlets in your home yes you don't have to get rid of them you just retrofit these babies in there and this centerpiece uh -huh. adds a whole new level of functionality to the outlet so for example oh by the way that's a camera oh yeah so if you need a nanny cam yes right a teenager cam a teenager <laughs> feel about that? How do we feel about that? I feel okay with it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought immediately of the bedroom and I wouldn't want one oh, in there, but there you go. Right. I would feel no so maybe for sure. Just in the rec room, the basement. Look at you this know. one. Nightlight. Oh, that's so, so cute. This is totally, totally affordable. You just swap out your existing outlets. So that's called and a this Swidget, right by the way. Swidget. A Swidget, a which USB. is a cute little name. And here 
I love this one too. In the event that there's a power outage, okay. this is battery operated. So you'd have oh, nice. an immediate light that you could use. So I love it. So awesome. many different options you can just yeah. slide in Did there. Did I even mention this great one? Which that one? Night light. Oh, cute. Isn't that fabulous? Yeah, that's, for, that's like, really nice. Seriously, so smart. And it, it's not, you know, like the big thing that you need to stick into the wall. Like, that's lovely mm -hmm. and it's subtle, it's super tiny. Super affordable and the kind of thing your husband might get super excited about. Yeah. Wi-Fi booster, all kind of like, you know, nice. talk to your Alexa or whatever, that kind of right. stuff. Right. Okay. The techie things. These, these, this would be hard to guess, I think. Stilts. Still, I don't stilts. know. As a matter of fact, they are stilts. And they are stilts that have a power outlet. And what you do with these, you need four of them. Yeah. You lift your bed seven inches off the floor. Oh. And suddenly you have great storage underneath your bed, okay. which is amazing, right? Yes. And then you also have an outlet where you need it. Because have you ever noticed that the outlet's always behind where the bed goes? That's right. Right? And then you're trying to plug it's in the vacuum tricky. cleaner or you want to charge a phone or whatever. Yes. So you've got outlets and USBs right where you need them next to the night table. Very cool cool and I, I've actually I've never heard of those which is amazing bed now, bath and beyond bed bath and beyond now there are so many different like secret little um, items you can get yeah. in your home uh, like this Murphy bookcase so we've heard of a Murphy bed yes this is a Murphy bookcase yeah. so it looks like a bookcase like right totally right. normal and then it's really a door <laughs> into our room. so it looks like it's very hidden like cool you know, like a secret passageway. It's very cool. Well, yeah, in all honesty, if you had a safe yes. or you had some valuables you didn't want people to know about, or yeah. if your husband just wanted to feel like Batman and come bursting out of the bat cave, yeah. right? Like, it's so cool, right? Now, there's also one you can buy, uh, a kit you can actually buy from Home Depot. Also from Home Depot. Um, that is um, the, the Murphy bookcase, and I think that's so cool. So you can buy I, that and have that installed. Super practical, very right? Very practical. Yeah. Now, you had a whole kitchen <laughs> that operated as a bit of like a labyrinth. <laughs> like That's when it was when everything was closed, you had doors on everything, That's and it was so almost like, where does Kimberly cook? Right, people come in and go like, where's your kitchen? I'm like, oh, you're standing in my kitchen. It's all yeah. there. So the doors open up to reveal coffee maker and, and the refrigerator on one side, and the oven and the stove on the other side, which I think so I've used cool. twice anyway. <laughs> uh, however, I do want to say when you hide power outlets like that, when you yes. hide some big power, you want to make sure you have a licensed electrical contractor look yeah. at that because they have to install what is known as a kill switch mm -hmm. so that whenever those doors shut everything powers down because yes. we got a lot of power behind doors that's right you so, can't do the microwave and the stove and all of that stuff and not have yeah. a kill switch so much you can do yourself but yeah. not electrical not, not electrical. not ever not no, no, even no, no, no 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 that's right now I'm gonna okay, go over let's here. talk about this contraption here so you've spent all this money on a beautiful front door yes and the very last thing you want right yeah is a screen in front of it true so Thank you, phantom screens, because now you can have a retractable screen that fully pulls away when the door is shut. Oh. So you can appreciate how pretty the door is. Oh, very nice. Okay, so Does you just have it there when you want it there. Have it there when you want. Of course they do windows. Of course they do even, you can do up to 40 feet and do a screen porch, for example, that comes oh, down beautiful. from the ceiling. Yeah. But this is a, a latch and release technology. It's super easy. Yeah. You want to make sure there's every color in the world you can get here. You can customize it. The, the uh, mechanism, the discrete mechanism that the screen goes back into, you want to match it to the door frame. Right. Always. So if you have a separate color for your front door yeah you want to make sure to match to the door frame but keep in mind like my personal preference would be all of the frame and the door to be the same, same color because it looks much bigger oh I like that much idea more generous and inviting. that's beautiful all yeah. of these hidden little talents is very nice 